I'm relatively new to sports betting and FanDuel. In my conversations of partnering with them, it was really important for me to understand the tools that are available to be responsible and really healthy about it all. As a number one leader in the industry, you have to be forward thinking, you have to sort of set the tone. You were a three-time Patriot champion, your team ran the NFL, and you guys led by example, right? It's the same sort of concept, I think, with FanDuel. So things like time limits, things like deposit limits, being able to take a break. There's so many tools and resources to protect my fans who have sort of followed me and want to absorb my content. I wanted to protect them. So that's what responsible gaming means to me. You want to be able to set yourself up uh, to where if you lose, uh, you can pay your bills, you know, you're not worried about that. You can, you know, go out and get a dinner steal. You can put food on the table for your children. You definitely don't want to get to that level where you're risking all of that. Yeah, I, you're both right. Like, responsible gambling to me means gambling should be fun and recreational. And as soon as it's not, it's not good for you. It's not healthy for you, financially, emotionally, relationship-wise. And to me, the meaning, it's a very simple meaning of responsible gambling is just that. Once it goes from fun and recreational to anything else, it's a problem. For most people, the far majority of people, that's what gambling is, whether it's sports gambling, casino gambling, or anything in between, it's fun, it's recreational. And once it goes beyond those two things, it's a problem.